What's up, YouTube? What's up, y'all? Yeah, this is the CMG versus Paper and Empire video. But this part part two because I think I already made one. Or some shit like that. I don't know. But anyway, the reason I wanted to talk about this, bro, is because there's a lot of buffoonery going on with this goddamn B. A whole lot of buffoonery. Pure buffoonery. I'm going to start by saying it. Young Dolph. Bro, these motherfuckers done shot at you. Come here. Shot up your car. They didn't shot you in your ass. Um, it just, and I know they ain't shot him recently, bro. But it, just, just in general, bro. Even though, cause th that beef's not dead, bro. That's not dead, bro. All that fuck you when you tell a nigga fuck you and fuck his bitch and you tell a nigga he lame and he a puss ass nigga and you talk you, you talk about a nigga's team that he built and put money into and they even hustle together and you talking these niggas you saying these niggas are faggots and shit they not real men I'm, listen to me bro I'm not even a gang if a nigga says if, if, if young Dolph said half the shit he said to your guy to me I don't give a fuck if it's 10 years later my nigga you gonna eat everything you said nigga everything every, all that shit gonna get paid back nigga all of it I don't give a fuck fuck you nigga you gonna pay all that back I'm gonna make you nigga every motherfucking word, nigga. You'll be lucky if you'll be lucky. Each word with me is a stab wound, but for any other nigga, each word is a fucking bullet, nigga. Alright? So, that for all y'all to say in this video is who old, nigga, that beef ain't over. Trust me, that beef ain't over. Um Whenever you Alright. Let's break down like from the beginning, okay? CMG. You got Yo Gotti. Started, I don't remember when Yo Gotti came out, like 2006, right? Yo Gotti was young in the game, bro. You got Yo Gotti. You know? You got Black Youngster. And a whole plus, I want to just, I, these are the only four artists I know. And I, only, I fuck with Black Boy JB Heavy. That's the reason I know about CMG. You know, you got Moneybag Yo, you got Black Boy JB, you got Black Youngster. And more artists, forgive me if I don't know the name. You got Yo Gotti, who was the head, you know, CMG. You know? Now, Paper Round Empire, you got Young Dolph, you got Key Glock. All right. Um, okay. We already know that most rappers cap, my nigga. We know that most of these niggas, when they get in their songs, talk about killing and murder and selling dope. A lot of niggas lying. They never done that in their life. It just sounds good. Some of these niggas have done that shit. Um... Some of these niggas just, uh, some of these niggas have been around people that have done it. And so they, like, talk about other people's life experiences and shit. And, um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know, man. We, we know that, that pretty much that's capped, though, right? So we're not, we're not really gonna try to penalize nobody for rapping and not doing what they said. But when, all right. All these guys are out of South Memphis. This is my thing, too. This is my thing where I don't get why. This is my thing where I say Young Dolph clout chase from the beginning starting to beef, and he going to have to pay for that shit. And I'm, and I'm a Young Dolph fan of his music and stuff, but that was just, to me, bro, that was a lot of goofy-ass behavior, bro. Like, ain't no, like, like for all the shit you was talking, bro, ain't no CMG nigga got shot. Ain't none of these niggas got robbed. You know, you're, you're not in these niggas' neighborhoods. You started to be. You don't want to start to talk about some, you know, and um, and, you know, and I don't even say you started to be, because I understand kind of where it came from. Well, you know, that's what I say. No, 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 take that back. I'm not gonna say that you started it because I remember from the beginning, your Gotti. You know what I'm saying? You didn't want to sign your Gotti, and he had kind of dish you saying he the biggest boss in the city, you know. But um, for you to uh. 
take it to the level you took it to? Like, cause you could have just said an underground this, or you could have just said you don't, you, you know, don't be mad that I signed a CMG. You know what I'm saying, or some shit like that. But for you to say fuck them and all that, and you ain't retaliated yet, or, or to me, to me, when you gonna say a nigga fuck you? To, in my mind, if you gonna tell me fuck me and fuck my family and my gang and my clique and you know what I'm saying, the shit I represent and my girl and my babies and you know what I'm saying, you'll, you'll shoot up with my baby mama staying where my mama stay at, my nigga, you better be ready to shoot me after you say that because you're not going to say that shit to me, bro, and then go back and go home and lay down and eat a sandwich like, nigga, fuck that. We're going to get that shit handled. And, um, but you to say all the shit you said about fucking this baby mama and all this shit, man, you know, you take, when you bring somebody's baby mama into something, that's, uh, that's his family, whether he's with her or not. You know what I'm saying? So for you to say you fucking that nigga baby mama, but you're not trying to kill him or hurt him or none of that shit, that's just stupid, bro. And you prone, you, that's prone behavior to get you hurt, bro. Nobody take threats lightly, bro. Nobody take, nobody like getting laughed at or none of that shit. Especially when you're famous, you got to, you, you, these niggas, y'all from the same city, so people know both y'all and you, and, y'all, and then this nigga famous. Worldwide renowned, you know what I'm saying? So... I don't know, man. I feel like you you, you started a hornball by doing that, bro. You're, I'm not saying that paper route is the big too, bro. Like I said, I know there's a lot of Young Dolph fans. There's a, there's a lot of paper route fans, just like there's a lot of CMG fans. But you got to realize what him, you, I, you know what? I'm going to say, yeah, you know, I pretty much, I guess, Yo Gotti is in the industry. You could say Young Dolph isn't, I guess, if you want to. Yeah, but I think you, you get industry money, but supposedly you're not in the industry, so I'm just going to play like you say you're independent, so Dolph is independent. So for you to be independent, bro, you is getting a lot of bread. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie about that. But his arm, but him in the industry, his arms are longer than yours, bro. And the only reason they ain't touched you because they fucked up them two times. Now I can actually say that. You know, they that is they bad fuck up on that C on that uh, C double I C double A shooter thing, whatever the um the basketball tournament and shit like that, the fact that they missed twice, that is dumb. You know, so they so they can't retaliate back. So that's good in your favor for now, bro. But I don't know, man. I'm looking at some of these old videos of when this nigga started this beef, talking about, you know, fuck them, fuck them CMG. I don't know. Even just, like, the younger niggas, bro. Like, you got Key Glock, bro. As, as talented as Key Glock is, Key Glock don't look... You don't... I don't know, bro. I'm, I, I fuck with your music, bro, but you don't look like no shooter to me. I'm sorry. Maybe y'all think Key Glock is a killer and stuff like that. But to me, you don't come off like no killer, bro. You come off like a... Like a... I don't know, just like a regular dude, but I think he, they play basketball or something. Like, you, you got the way. I'm not trying to say that niggas, niggas, they, they killers ain't got ways or something like that, but you just come off kind of like a, like too smooth, bro, to be and to talk about half the shit you talk about. Like, you out here robbing niggas and, and doing stick ups. You can't really do stick ups like that. And, and I don't know. You just don't come off like that. Your energy just don't come off like that, bro. You just don't read like that. Now, Black Boy JB, he comes off like that. You know, you can tell he out the hood and shit like that. We not even just by the videos, but just by the aura, the way he speaks, or the way he handles himself. Uh, his track record shows it, and his uh, police record shows it. Black youngster, we can say the same. Uh, Money bag yo is a question. I don't, I don't really know. Cause Money bag yo did some real. Money bag, you did some that Rollo shit. You did was really scary. And for you not to own up to it, I ain't gonna lie, brother. What? I, I, Money bag yo, I put you on the same level as Kegelot. I'm sorry, bro. Cause. And I don't care about people saying, oh, you're not a gangster. Bro, not, listen, bro, I'm a man, you motherfucker. So at the end of the day, I'll fight, and I know I'll defend myself, and I'm not scared of anything but y'all Elohim, nigga. So it's a difference. What? You think, young? Oh, let me go ahead. Um, anyway. And like I was saying, um, I don't know, but I'm going to put you kind of on the same level as him. But you really don't really do anything. I don't know, you don't really do much, bro. And uh, the way you was copping please on the breakfast club, that was kind of real scary to me. I ain't gonna lie, that was some extra scary shit, bro. The way you were just going over your words. When you could have just said that hey, either you got money or you didn't. I, don't, I ain't never known no rapper that uh, don't know if he got paid or not. I don't know if the money was good. Nigga, they not, you, that's not their money, it's your money. And then the day. Yeah, they get a 10% cut or 5% cut or whatever they get, bro. But it's your money, it's your at the end of the day, it's your, um, it's your money, bro. So, um, uh, I 
Nå, mand. 